Hi, my name is Will White. I'm the Solar Application Specialist at Fluke here with the 283 FC Multimeter. We're going to talk about the limit gauge. The limit gauge is a really helpful feature where if you're doing repetitive measurements, it allows you to very easily see if the measurement is outside of pre-specified range. So for example, if you're testing voltage in a DC combiner box on a solar array, and you want to make sure that all the strings are within a certain range, very easy to allow the technician to see if the measurement is outside of that range. When we set the limit gauge, we turn it onto the measurement that we want to take, and the limit gauge works for both AC and DC voltage and current measurements. We turn to the limit gauge button. We can set the limit gauge in one of three ways, by percentage, so we can set it for a certain measurement, say 1400 volts, and then plus or minus a certain percentage, maybe 10%. If the measurement is outside of that range, it will beep and it will light up the display so we know very easily that we're outside of that limit. We can also set the limit by a certain number, so if we want to go from 1300 volts to 1500 volts, as long as the measurement is within that range, uh, it won't show any notification. We can also recall previously used limits. So if you're doing repetitive testing, maybe moving from combiner box to combiner box, once you set that limit gauge in, it's set in the tool and you can very easily recall that. So it's a great feature for doing repetitive tests and making sure you don't miss something out of the ordinary. For more information, visit the 283FC page on fluke.com.